We are on Mesechet Kelim, Perak Yud Zayin, Mishnah Tedvav. 15th Mishnah, the 17th chapter of Mesechet Kelim. It's a long cap chapter. Uh, so the Mishnah is, again, sort of like summing up just different rules. Really interesting. Hauseh kli kibul mikol makom tamei. If you make kli kibul, kli kibul are, as remember we said, anything that can hold something. So anything that really holds anything, interestingly, then it's then it's tamei. You look at the different Kelim that you have nowadays, like if you wonder, is like this thing holds papers. So is this a kli kibul? Because it, it can hold the papers? Or, or is it because if I put water in it or something, it would fall out? Really interesting. That's why they have post game. I wonder what's going to be. Anyway, so if it's something that has a clay kibul that can hold anything, like it does hold the papers. Tame. Hausem mishkav umoshav. If you make you make something that's a mishkav umoshav, something used to be la, lay upon or sat upon. Mikol makom. Meaning, liyeshiva mu'etit. Even a certain amount, a small amount. Gon shaya nish'an onit lebo. Right, he was, it was, it was leaning on or hanging by it. I, I guess he was hanging on the thing. I don't know. Tame, then it's makabel tuma. Hausek keys. If you make a pocket, that's also a clay kibul. Me or a matzah. See, I will look this up. Or a matzah. The skin of a matzah. See, if you look at the Wikipedia entry on matzah, it appears this idea of or ha matzah. Okay, chomer bilti meubad. Something that's not, uh, that's not processed. That's called or ha matzah. I really, I, otherwise, I have no idea what or matzah was. Now, it's, I think their matzah was not our matzah. Their matzah was bread. So if you, if, if, if the, if it, if it was, it was like pita, like, um, like, uh, ishtanur. So they made this, use the matzah and make something? I really don't know. It, it must refer to something they knew about. Maybe it, when you made the matzah, you made the dough, it had a, like a skin on top of it that, that was usable. No idea. Min haniyar. If you know, by the way, send me an email or WhatsApp me. And we'll dedicate, well, we'll dedicate our learning memory to my father, Rav Simcha Ben Yitzchak Kalman, while we are at it. Minaniya, or from paper. I don't know what they made paper from. They made it from, Bartidur says, from grasses. No idea. Tame. Okay, now, Harimon Ha'alon. If you have a Rimon, and a Rimon is a pomegranate. Alone is like an oak tree, but if you look at it alone, again, it's like you make it from an acorn. Really, remember, it's any amount. You can use, use an acorn. Palestine oak. Fascinating. Okay. Or it goes, a nut. Shechakakum. You hollowed it out. Hatinokot, their children hollered out, Lamod be'em et afar. Lamod, I think it means to like evaluate or to estimate, to, to measure the dirt. Kids are playing and they hollered it out to make a toy. Oshit kinum le kafmoznaim. Or you attach them on your kafmoznaim, on your scales, on your weighted scales. Tame. Why? Shiyesh le ma'aser ve'en le machshava. Okay, because you, if you did, because you did something, you did an act in order to make them a ma'aser. So it is very weird. The Bartunari says the following. He says, no. But if, so if you did a ma'aseh, you didn't have machshava, you didn't intend to make it into a cleave, the ma'aseh was enough. But if you didn't do a ma'aseh, but if you thought to use it to measure dirt, the way they are, let's say you found a, an acorn, or you found a, you found a, you found a, a like a, a, a fruit shell, a pomegranate shell, nice and big pomegranate shell. And you're like, oh, I can use this. You didn't actually, you would hollow it out yourself. You didn't do anything to it. Then it's called a pshute. It's like just regular like pshute cleates or whatever. And therefore, your intention is not enough to make it tuma. You have to add, the Bartonera says, you have to either do a ma'aseh or ma'aseh plus ma'achshava. Of course, that certainly would make it into a cleave, but it's the ma'aseh. Not just machshava, not just intent on its own. Right, we dedicated our learning, so if you know what or hamatzah is, you have a way of figuring that out. Reach out; I'd love to know. Make it a great day.